Hello, Oz here, and I'm going to answer a question that came up tonight. So this puzzle goes like this. We know the site, cost, number of days, given travel, and just having time to take something in, really, and the city. So a person comes in and says that they have a budget of say $1,200 and they have four days. Okay, Eiffel Tower does not work. Wrigley Field, okay, that would work. Picasso would work. Louvre is over the maximum amount of time, but it's, um, yeah, and it's over the $1,200. Okay, but let's do it like this. Let's say the budget is $1,200 and the time is four days. Go and insert slicer. Okay, have to be in the table when we do that. Slicer, site, cost, days, city. Excellent. Now these can be a bit clunky because they're so big, but they're helpful. And this is something else that is not in Mac. Okay. Cool. So now, four days. Let's say we want to look at four, three and a half, three, and two. Those are the options we want to look at, and the budget is twelve hundred. Let's go ahead and say eleven eighty to let's see. We we'll use my control button here and say down to one thousand forty five. So our choices are now down to these Wrigley Field, Navy Pier, Statue of Liberty. Stone Arch Bridge in Minneapolis, Independence Hall and the Rodin Museum in Philadelphia. Okay. Suppose we want to clear these and say that our budget is now, say, $2,000. What's available now? And we're still at four days. And let's look, go ahead and stretch it a little bit and say four and a half four, three and a half, three. All right, and our budget of $2,000. Let's look, 1,875. All right. So this, all right. So these are our only options. Greenwich Village are the McCord Museum in Montreal. We see this grayed out. Okay, we might want to look at this 800, 1800, but that's not an option for us and it's limited by the time that we have. So these are our only options based on the time and the budget. So let's do another. Let's clear the filters. Now our entire set of choices is back. Now let's look at $1,500 and we have eight days. All right, so this is all in order and we have a budget of $1,500. Let's say, go ahead, $1,600. Look at those, and we have eight days. Let's look at both the six and 11 day options. Okay, so now we've got Eiffel Tower, Louvre, and the Biodome as our choices. So hopefully this answers the question. And uh, yes, yeah, send me any more questions that you have, and I will see about getting an answer for you. Thanks a lot.